is giving us such an exciting next match coming up. And this Chris Adcock and Pia Zebadia versus Gabriela Adcock, Chris's wife, and player versus Ku and Kukien. Gabriela Adcock had a very good game, very good outing yesterday with Akshay Devalkar. Is this man 8:30 from Malaysia? Ku Kien was on the court before with Dan. Is 1-1 a lost one? And the opponent, Chris Adcock from England. Commonwealth Games gold medalist, World Championship silver medalist, very accomplished mixed doubles and men's doubles player. And Pia Zebadia, of course, hailing from Indonesia, the younger sister of Marcus Kiddo. Begin proceedings then, Pia to the first serve. They're off the mark then. The other at top, Gabriel and a partner Ku. They come roaring right back here. Chris Adcock and Pia have leveled it at one all. Long rallies down to the wire. It's all about creating openings. It's all about hitting down those big winners. They've got some sort of a lead here. They have put some daylight to ever play together. It is the first time for both of them on the court. So the team that combines well will have an obvious advantage over the other. That's what we've seen thus far in this Star Sports Premier Badminton League. The scratch combinations have definitely not disappointed and created some upset. And why not with excellent shots like that from Chris Adcock? I think they'd be ready to beat even the best, the best of the pairs in the world. Well, we have nothing to tell us that either of the teams are settled as yet. Gabrielle Adcock knowing all her husband's secrets. Chris Adcock knowing all her wife's secrets. Bringing on the surprises and we just wait for the surprises from Chris Adcock and Gabrielle Adcock. Oh. Level it at seven all now. It's a serve over after every point, quite literally. gone out at the first game interval Adcock and Pia lead the other pair eight points to seven welcome back uh, there is nothing to choose between the two teams here Pia Zebadia and Chris Adcock they do have a lead but it is only a one point lead which can disappear in the blink of an eye extended it here it is nine points to seven Three points lead for them now. Superb cross court shot. Pia Zebadia seeing the opening there at the net. Superb wrist work from her there. Bit slow to react there too. This is a good lead here. And only in a 15 point format, it is 12 points to 7. Get into the shot wrong there, Pia Zebadia. But we've seen some great doubles action from our brother Marcus Kiddo, and Pia Zebadia is not disappointing us either. Two with his trademark, trademark back flick there. Did well, and the Chennai Smashers have game point in this first game. Just putting it out there, Pia. That's what Gabriel Adcock had in mind even on the previous point when she made that service error, but this time not faltering at all. She did so yesterday with Akshay Devalkar. Missed that one, Chris Adcock. A good shot. 
and the difference now just one point Delhi Aces have crept up so very very good comeback here and we are going to the decider point how good is this by Adcock and Kobe talked, of, talked about their experience they are showing every bit of it here great service there by Gabriel Adcock Unfortunately, Chris Adcock's string snapped on that. Yeah, it is sudden death. <laughs> Superb by Gabriel Adcock. <laughs> Very good rally to finish off here. Good teamwork there from Chris Hippia. <laughs> giving that everything but it has been returned but this time though what a comeback what a comeback by gabriel adcock and ku keith kian they take the first game they lead one game to zero gabriel adcock and ku keith keen were down by 14 to 9 they came roaring back and snatched that no. game this is what badminton is all about not just the heart smashes but agility and explosiveness how about that leap up on now? 1.5 by Chris Adcock. 1.5 meters translates to almost 5 feet, Siddharth. Superb jumping from Chris Adcock. One of the fittest and fastest players on circuit. What athleticism. And he will be needing that. Game. Much, much better. They need to get organized here. The unforced error stat tells the story. They've had 6 unforced error, Chris Adcock and Pierre. Spectacular stuff. Spectacular stuff by the more experienced Kuki Kin. Just look at the way he reacted and just managed to put that shuttle back in play. It was almost behind his shoulder. Exceptional by Gabriel Adcock, just out by Kudo and Zebadia and Chris Adcock take the point and take the lead. Four points to three, they lead. Great defense there from Gabriel Adcock. Cook and Kit, of course. The span of 24 hours must be really tough for him. Superb stuff there from Chris Adcock. But yes, as you mentioned, Cook and Kit did play that long rally of 66 shots yesterday but today he bettered it at 91 shots in that rally but as i keep saying he is one of the fittest players on circuit today gabriel adcock does very well on the net bread and butter for her she's not going to miss those Getting the lead for Chris and Pia, 8-5 in the second game. And I think they will have to put in that kind of steam to win this game if the lead extends, but not so. Chris letting the pressure. Just a two-point lead then. Good defense by Ku, but just could not keep it in play. It's a three-point lead going into the final straight of the second game.
That's out. That will do well for Chris Atkom and Pia Zabadia. 11 points to 7 the lead. And if they've learned anything from that first game loss. They have kept them well within reach here. Pia Zebadia doing very well until that moment. Good return to Ku, but uh, finally it went out and it's only a two point lead. Missing that one, Pia. Scores leveled at 11 all. Yes, one comeback is hard enough to handle, but two will be heartbreaking for the Chennai Smashers. Ball. Protesting of that shot of Chris Adcock, saying that Chris Adcock's bracket did touch the net on that winning shot. And the Pai agrees, point to the Delhi Aces. So look at that. Certainly his racket did touch the net. Good call by the Empire. Very good call by the Empire. And good retrieval by Ku, but Chris Adcock with a winner there ties it at 12 all. It's also in context of the tie-up, but now Chennai Smashers would have ideally wanted to win this match and set it up well for Sindhu to come later on and win the Trump and really take the tie beyond the reach of the Delhi Aces. Well, the first game finished 15 to 14, and now we are at 13 all. But Gabriel Adcock more than makes up for an error here. They are on match point here. What a shot there from Gabriel Adcock. Players like Ku and Chris. What a point this is. And we are going to the decider. Back to back games have gone to the decider here, Upper. Now, what a match we are having. Just shows how keenly contested this match is, how evenly matched these pairs are. Pia to serve again. They have saved the match for the time being. Have Chris Adcock and Pia Zebadia. And they've turned the tables from 15 14. They have won their own second game 15 to 14. We will see you after the break for the decider. Turn that was from Gabrielle Adcock. She was certainly in trouble at that point. Chris knew where the shot was coming but made a mess of it at the net. Look at that. In trouble was Gabrielle Adcock. A challenge, is it? Lines is there. No challenge. Okay. Extraordinarily long pause. But there we have it. And the shuttle has been called out. Unsuccessful. Long rally here. Ah! Shot from Ku right into the body of Pia. She had no time to make room to return that smash. Very, very good smash here. Look at that. 37 shots were the rally until Ku drove that straight at Pia. shot from Ku in that rally. But Chris Adcock making short work of that shot. 
Look at the way he moves. Such a good mover on the court. The agility of this man never ceases to surprise you. It's just super. And it is just 5 4. There's nothing to choose between the two teams. Six. But just could not get the winner in. Great chance on that point. Created the opening there, but could not finish it off. Look at the disappointment on his face. Oh, wow. Well done there by Adcock and Pia at the third game interval. They lead Gabriel Adcock and Ku by eight points to six. Good way to start there, but now. And the Star Sports Premier Badminton League. What a platform that is to kickstart their preparations in an Olympic year. Yes, Chris has played the previous Olympics at London. Yeah, best of luck from us for both of them. We hope they make it. But right now, it's about making it through this match. The Delhi Aces really need Gabriel and, and Ku to win this match for them. The comeback king and queen. Great determination and courage shown by Ku, but he just could not return that. Pia doing very well to force him back there. Just look at the commitment from Ku on that one. Holds nothing back. He knows how important this match is for the Delhi. Beautiful rally here. Neither pair giving an inch to the other. Marvelous, marvelous stuff by both the pairs. Who wants this point more? And they've done it. They have won. What is his state of mind and can he take this because it's really, this is unbelievable from him really. I don't have words to express the amount of work that he's put in. Yes, after he won that point, 66, 63 shot rally, I beg your pardon. He did drop his racket down and took in all the applause from the Delhi Aces dugout. Getting his breath back, ready to start. This next point is Gabriel Adcock which is a very important point. It could be match point if they win it. Yeah! Not so superb smashing from Chris Adcock. Really tense moments here. Unfortunate, very unfortunate, but who and Gabriel Adcock have the match point. Well, it seems to be going as per plan so far for the Delhi Aces. Can the Chennai Smashers make a comeback? Yeah. What reaction there from Chris? Oh, yeah. oh, Super yeah. seemed to be in trouble on that point. Got his racket up just in time. Just look at that. Such a brilliant shot from him. First rate badminton from Chris Adcock. Madhumita Bish can barely believe it. Humongous point on its way here. Oh, 
Let's just hold our breaths. What a match we have witnessed here. This is superb stuff. Exceptional, exceptional game of mixed doubles we have just witnessed. All high fives and hugs at the Chennai dugout. This is only the third time a team has won a match after losing the first game in the Star Sports Premier Badminton League. And what a time to do it. What a way to do it. Full credit, full marks to Chris Adcock and Pia Zebadia. Really superb, superb display of badminton from them. It's all joy on the Chennai bench and all sorrow on the Delhi dugout.